What's up, Brigaders? Here we go again. Now, finally, first day fishing here in Norway. Yoo -hoo! Okay, Brigaders, this is how a day of fishing in Norway starts. Fully loaded with all the equipment. We are heading now down to the first boat trip in, in Norway now, to Hallesult with our colleague and friend from last year. With absolutely stunning, beautiful weather today outside here. So, yes, I hope it can be. And he calls already where I am. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so, got ready. Heading down the hotel stairs. We're behind the view again. Getting ready to the car. And heading down to Hallesult to get some nice fishes today, hopefully, from the boat. Absolutely starting perfectly weather. Just a little bit of cloudy, should be the whole day like that. So, I hope to see you soon. Hallesult is the place here in Norway to go fishing. Okay, doggies, on top that sticky stickster, my colleague of today for the fishing brigade is late. Now, he didn't make any sandwiches, so he's stopping now, or we are stopping now at the moment here at the local grocery shop, eh, which is called here in Norway, Kiwi. And he's gonna get some lunch, some whatever, and then we're hitting the road. Uh, today we are trying to catch first some bait fishes and with those bait fishes trying to get something bigger out of the fjords because out of the um, information from our friend with the boat here, um, the local guy, it's uh, very, yeah, what we say like empty at the moment the fjords to, to be honest, uh, saying like that there are very small Pollack Zeus, uh, which is called here and um, yeah, so this is why we're gonna try with some bait fish like in the middle water to catch something. Of course, we're gonna go probably on the bottom to see if there are some halibuts or some flatfish or whatsoever swimming around there and hopefully interested for our bait. But I think this is the part of how it's gonna be from today, how we're gonna start today. And yes, I'm very, very mm, curious as well to see it because we have again a huge, as you saw before, weather change and uh, it's getting warm as well now with sun. And everything I hope it's gonna affect it positively but we're gonna see at the end how and what is gonna happen so stay tuned now with the fishing brigade we're waiting just for sticky sticks like always and uh, we see you there in Hallesold in this gators is the beautiful view on the way down to our fishing spot through this beautiful and magnificent country of Norway is it not beautiful Okay, can I introduce you now finally on the fishing brigade, my man Sticky Stickster today on a fishing trip going to Hallesol to our colleague from last year which was in one of the episodes already to see. We're gonna go off his boat, uh, enjoying a fantastic day. What is your thinking about what we're gonna get today? Halibut, I hope. Halibut. You hear it there, we see and hope that we're gonna get some halibut. Eh? A quick pit stop to pick up <clears throat> our colleague at his beautiful farm here in Loan in Norway. Absolutely a place to be. Event book possibilities here, like with four live concerts, you can make barbecue parties and stuff. They are producing their own wine and a lot of another lovely other things they are gonna show you or tell you later a little bit more about it. And uh, yeah, we are just waiting for him at the moment now to pick him up and go hit down the waters, which you can see here. This is what we're gonna fish in this stunning looking fjord. I'm getting excited! Stiggy, tell our audience and our people, how is it called this name here? This place, sorry. Where we are now, it's called Ljön. Okay. And uh, then, ten, uh, five, ten minutes further down, it's Hellesylt. 
Hellesol. This is the place where we are going now fishing with our colleague. Yeah, that's right. it. That's nice. And guys, if you see here around, we are waiting at this farm. And look around here. I mean, is this beautiful or is this beautiful? I think it's one of the most, and there he comes already. One of the most beautiful places here so far I see in Norway. And yeah, today with absolutely stunning weather as well. Going to the workshop with the boys, picking up finally some fishing gear for the boat. And then finally hitting this water. Look at this guy. Is this nice or is this nice? And here is back our man on the camera here, Ole Yalmar. If you hey. remember, here man on his farm getting some fishing equipment ready here now for the boat. Some doors and try to hit the big ones today. Perfectly stunning weather. Lucky wise, eh? after two weeks, the first day really good sunshine and really warm as well for here. Stig is also super motivated already. Are you? Yes, this one yes. I want to see. Yep, yep. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, just want to show you one more thing here on the farm. I mean, the last time already here, but I was working and I didn't have the camera with me. Look at this, please. Is this maybe one of the most beautiful views out of a toilet worldwide? Oh yeah, I guess. Look at this. And here, woo! Imagine you sit here. And you know, I mean, more relaxed it cannot be on a toilet, for sure. Behind me here, we arrive finally to the harbor where we're gonna pick up the boat now in a little bit to go fishing. Here is not such a good sign, I don't know if you see it here in the water, there. There's a dead fish already swimming. So let's see, but here, there's a small harbor. I don't know which boat it is, it's gonna be this year. And look at this, where we are here. Ooh. And if you see as well, the small kids are fishing here from the harbor wall. The small little girl got tangled now, but yay. Super beautiful. What do you think, Stiggy? Is this a place to go fishing today? Yeah, no? Yeah. It's amazing, beautiful. no? We are it's so lucky. Really nice. So lucky with the weather as well. Like, uh, yeah. I think we're gonna have really a lot of fun. Hope that just the fishes are gonna bite this time. Yeah. Yay! Some big ones. <laughs> yeah, man, for sure. Have some nice barbecue in the afternoon. As you see, just for the VIPs. Ooh. Our boat for today. With this spectacular waterfall there in the background. In this pillow here. Unbelievable. So far, our fishing gear for today. Some big rods, some middle light rods, some trolling rods, everything here at the start to be prepared for whatever it's gonna bite. I don't know if it's gonna be very successful today because, on the other hand, we, what I said before already, we have a big weather change at the moment. So, as you see, it's like super, super nice being, uh, being here in the nice weather condition. And Ole is starting straight away from the pier. It's no time to lose here. Yee! On the bottom. Nice. No, probably too much reflection. It is like this typical mackerel jigs as well as like a three, four hook system with a bottom weight. He lets it down <coughs> and just jigs it like certain meters up and let it down again. Nice. Let's see, this is the construction, three hooks with some plastic, yeah, sort of calamars it's on and with a bottom pilger, I'm guessing around 60 to 80 grams and he's trying to check it out where we can get some bait fish now right. first From the pier with a pilg of 30 grams just letting it down for some say uh, which is going to be the bait fish today just let it sink to the bottom, we'll say about 25 meters here more or less and yeah, like 25 to 30, men, uh, 30 centimeter size is perfect because we're going to use them later on the boat for for some bait. And we just let it sink down and let's see if we can get for you guys a live bite. You can see line is still going, going, going. Here we go. And super easy. Break super tight and like start to reel and jig a little bit. Let's see. We can get another one out for you guys. Alright, was not a live bite, but 
finally the first fish, Norwegian fish to say. We call it as well. Yeah, sea trout, sea lax in German. And we're gonna use this one now today for, and we catch them on a 30 gram jig here next to the pier. And we're gonna use this one here for bait today. So yeah, first one is on, first Norwegian fish. Okay, not so bad for the start. We have like a whole bucket full already of the size, which is gonna be the bait fish. Of course, I put even the GoPro in, on and no live bites for you guys. Well, let's see and hope that now on the boat, we're gonna change that and have some nice mamacitas on. Yippee! I mean the fishes, of course. Captain, all the Yalmar. Now here with Ole, with our guide there, he's explaining us at the moment what kind of fishing we're gonna do. Yeah, so this is uh, sand bottom and uh, I have several different types of uh, tackles we can use. We will do bait fishing, this is sand bottom and then you fish uh, flounder, halibut, if you're lucky you can catch a monkfish, uh, link cod, cod, yeah, some different types of fish. All right. It depends on how you do the tackle. All right, so we're gonna have a look as well at the tackle when he's gonna show this for us the first time, and uh, we hope we're gonna get like at least one of each. It will be fantastic. This is a flounder tackle. All right. So this one goes with, uh, I'm guessing, with uh, bait to the yeah. bottom. Yeah. Untangle it. Yeah, typical. Why should be easy? <laughs> but it's normal. Who, which is angler and doesn't know this? When you start up the first day of fishing again, like as a trip, and like, and you don't have the disaster in your team to be organized uh, box, but it always looks like that. That's nice. And it's on signal uh, pearls on it as well, like they have different colors and reddish and yellow. See a small spoon on it. So I'm guessing we're using the little drift in it, so it's gonna bleed a little bit around. Yeah, it's nice. Catch big on it, but you can also catch small. Right. Okay, guys, so I'm trying <coughs> the Canarian way with like 110, 120 gram jig with a uh, uh, pulpo, an octopus on it to see by any chance. And the breast mafic is it like this hanging open, completely the break, and let it go by itself. It's heavy enough. Like this, you go super quick to the bottom. And we know by the color of the line, 30 meters, 40, woo, 50 meters, and we arrive to the ground. Close it, quite tough, not so tough. Careful with the cam, Stiggy, careful with the camera is there. Wow. 
Well, as you see it goes also it's so heavy that it goes actually since we are vertical fishing super quick down to the bottom there we go 40 meters 40 and just go up and dig it let it sink again not sticking it up all the way since we're looking over sand here that we get some some flounders and stuff like to just dig it maybe the first 10 meters stop sometimes in between different varieties of jigging and we let it sink again bottom and here we go Now I'm gonna do it different. I'm gonna let it sink to the bottom again and I'm just gonna jig it around like one and a half, two meters over the ground and let it sink again and like that. Because the flounders normally are not that friendly to the rise. But well, since we don't know exactly what we're expecting on fishes today, is that I'm trying all different types of uh, jigging. So I'm on the bottom here, tuck, 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 tuck. Let's sing again. We are all trying on the bottom with different type of rigs that you saw before uh, some jigging as well and like with some bait construction and yeah now we're looking for another spot again because we are quite close to shore and see if we can get something gross salute okay and finally sticky sticker today with the first contact on the boat there the first fish in the drill nice let's see what it's gonna bring up Show me some more enthusiasm in your face. Yeah, man! <laughs> there you go, still deep, far away out. What is it gonna be? What is it gonna be? Let's see! There we go! Nice! Keep it tight, keep it tight, keep it tight, it's gonna go. Yeah, fish on okay. board! Nice! <laughs> Sticky! Give me an... <laughs> nice! Here we go, first fish in the boat. Go on. Left 
to hold it in front of the camera. The Beautiful fish. Yeah, you have to present it big. Yeah. Oh, look. It has uh, salmon Ooh, lice on it. All oh, right. Can you see this here, guys? Yeah. Sticky stickster with the fish of the day so far. Nice, oh, man. Sticky stickster with the fish. Ooh. Nice. Oh, Show me his mouth. Big mama. The grandmother. Yeah, man. Nice. Okay, guys, as you see, the weather changed dramatically. I couldn't film anymore because it was starting to rain quite a lot. Sticky Stickster here in the back is the only one, the game winner of the day, the only fish on board, but it doesn't matter. As long as we've been together out, we had our day off, we enjoyed, we had a fantastic day. So yeah, this is what it's about. I hope to see you next in the next episode of the Fishing Brigade. Next time probably for some trout fishing in some lakes or some rivers. And uh, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below and thumbs up are always welcome. So see you in the next one. This is Ronnie Ryan's Fishing Brigade. We are out.